imenisaidia sana kwa sababu nilipokuwa nikitumia tena mkebe ilikuwa inaleta madhara mengi kwa kifua na kwa macho lakini hasa hii haina madhara yote tunaitumia tunavyotaka when there is blackout we can continue the studies and we can extend our learning time and this has helped in improving our grades to have very few people uh, proceeding to high school, but now we have almost everybody going to high school because they have enough time to read, enough light to read, and there's no problem. We don't have the health problems we used to have while when they used to have the tin lamps because solar system is clean and they are able to study without break breaking or being sick. Kuna matatizo mengi ambayo tunapitia kutokana na hizi taa za koroboi. Kwa wakati mwingi zinaharibu macho umo shu unapotoka na inasumbua macho wakati mwingine tukika darasani ina sumbua machu na jikuna kuna alafu tena kama vile bei ya mafuta imepanda hivi wengine unaanza kusoma koroboi inaifika kwa nje inazima inabidi umeacha hapo kusoma hmm. <laughs> When the electricity goes off during our preps, maybe morning or evening preps, we are able to switch on the lights from the solar to enable us to control the youth. You know, dealing with the teenagers is not easy. So when the light goes off, we switch on the solar system and you are able to curb the, any other behavior that might crop in. pale nyuma tulikuwa tunaumia kwa sababu tulikuwa tunatumia mafuta taa akisoma alikuwa moshi inamletea madhara ile mafuta taa ikinukia harufu alikuwa anasema imletea kifua lakini siku hizi 
tangu tuliletewa sola katika shule ya Kambuli masomo ya mtoto wangu imekuwa mzuri hata tunapoenda katika wazazi katika shule sijai sikoto kilalamika mambo ya macho mambo yakikuwa vilikuwa nalalamika pale nyuma wakati tumwa kutata we share solar program is special because the blue solar suitcases for education are built by secondary school students as part of their science and engineering lessons and then donated to rural school or refugee camp in Kenya that lack electricity at all. This becomes a global exchange of service and connection from students to students. It is meant to be an entry point, solar system that can provide light and power for places that don't have reliable electricity. The solar suitcase was designed to be easy to maintain with high quality parts and drug to last in a harsh environment for about 15 years with proper maintenance and battery replacement. And adding on that, it's very free, it's donated, you don't need to pay anything. <laughs> 